Get him? Boy, it took a lot of reeling, but you got him. Another blue. No, I think I'm going to let them go. I think five's enough for now. That'll give my boys something to eat on. He straightened her out, didn't he? Yeah, he did. Pull the whole slack out. He, he must have been pulling that slack through that sinker slide because uh, it took you a long time to catch up with him. And sometimes those fish do that. They, they, that line goes through those sinker slides so slick that uh, they can swim off with that and never ever feel. Uh, let's let's take a look. Let me let me see that real quick here. I show everybody what I'm talking about. That, that uh, braided line goes through that sinker slide so easy that uh, those fish, fish never really feel, feel anything. And uh, I think a lot of times they pick it up and come at you. And that's why the uh, reeling method works so well because you're picking up so much more line rather than if you just picked up the rod and set the hook, you'd never get them. We have to get another takedown over here. Rusty just hooked a, another nice fish on this side of the boat. Pretty good fish. Good. Nice catfish. fish grips if I can get it. There you go. Nice one Rusty. That's our our best blue cat of the day right there by by a long shot. There you go healthy rascal boy he just you just seen the old tip of that rod just go down real slow and uh, Rusty, I didn't get to the camera in time, he was already pulling the pole down pretty good. So uh, anyway, we'll probably go, let's let that one go and uh, we're going to get another bait out there. It's just about time to go home, but uh oh, we got a pull down right here. One getting ready to go down anyway. Yeah, that's a nice one. Yeah, that's a nice fish, Rusty. Hold his side up where there you go with the fins right up here. See ya. See those colors on him shining in the sunlight. Beautiful catfish. Well, folks, he's stringing them, catching them faster than we can string them here right now. Again, I didn't get a chance to get that one on the camera. He just laid that three-quarter ton pole down. Pretty good fish. Another nice fish, Rusty? A little bigger than that other one. Think he is? I think so. Good. Well, it is an absolutely beautiful evening to be fishing. I mean, it is gorgeous. We don't have any wind. The fish are biting. Nice blue catfish. Out like that other. Nice fish. Let me grab your fish grip for you. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, you gotta love that. Got him. Nice one. There you go, healthy fat blue. Uh oh. Is that a fish? Yep. Uh oh. Well, let me have this one. Get him. He got the rod down. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is a pretty good fish here. <laughs> I'm gonna have to put this one down and get this. Is he? Oh, good God Almighty. Let me see if I can get this other line in. Pretty nice one. I got the video camera, it just sat down right here for a second. I think that's a little nicer than that last one. Oh. Nice one. Oh yeah, let me get the net. Will we get him with a grip? Yeah. Okay, you just hold him. I'll see if I can get him with the fish to hit my mouth. Well, that's, a, that's quite a double right there. Pull him up here a little bit. Got him. Oh, that's quite a deal doing that and filming. <laughs> fish here. That's a nice one now. Now we're gonna have you. I'm gonna have you hold both those up, cause that was uh, that's quite a double there, man. Pop the puppies out real quick. Woo! They laid them over. Oh, good. Yeah, he hooked himself. We just looked around, that rod was over, wasn't it? Yeah. I was trying to get that fish in the hood. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna... That's nice. Nah. Two beautiful blue catfish there tend to wind up the day. If I could get them to hold them up a little higher. You're, what are your arms quivering for, man? Yeah, those are nice. Let me have this one here and you can hold that biggest one up. Yeah. He'd swing his tail around. You can see how he's just, uh, just a real nice catfish. Probably close to 20 pounds. 25 pound maybe something like that 23 pounds just a nice catfish this one right here no slouch let me have that one he just not quite as big but still nice fish okay good day on the water beautiful evening well, that's 20 minutes in sunset now how cool was that? We just released Rusty's two fish. We got his picture taken. He put them back in the water. And we just wanted to say thanks for watching today. Uh, we hope these tips that we're doing at TeamCatfish.com help you become a better catfish angler. Today we went over how to cut up the shad, how to put them on a hook, and hopefully that's going to help you connect with more catfish. Uh, this is just absolutely gorgeous out here right now. Not a riffle on the water. I got a fish biting right here, you know. The rod's get well, I might have to get this one. And I did, but he's not very big. Well, he might be bigger than I thought.
Not a huge catfish, but just another nice one. Another one just like some of the other ones we've caught today. Oh, a good heavy catfish. Got the dot hook in his mouth. Now folks, if you don't like that, you're like my old buddy Scott Turnage says, you're a hard person to please. Come out here, enjoy this, watch our videos, learn how to become a better catfish angler. Thanks for watching. I'm Jeff Williams with Rusty Pritchard, TeamCatfish.com.